I'm currently on day 22 of my server and I just unlocked the Relic Rush event. And to be honest, I wasn't ready for that. I thought that we would need something around 125k to complete one round, but in fact you need 225k for every round. So in fact to complete the four rounds, you are gonna need 900k Relic Shards which is a huge amount. You can buy some extra there, but yeah, let's be honest, this is really expensive. 120K for 110 euros. So there is no way I'm buying this. So I'm gonna go there and this is what I saved. I don't have enough to clear two rounds, but during the week, I'm gonna have enough to complete the second round normally. So the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna search for relics to unlock the two ones I am missing for now. And then I'm gonna do what I did in the past, enhance all of them to level 1, then level 2, then level 3, etc. One by one. Because in fact, when you level up one, even if you are not using it, you are gonna get some permanent buffs right there. So for example, if I upgrade that, you are gonna see. Look at there. This is my current stats given by all the relics I have, okay? So I'm gonna go there, I'm gonna upgrade that one, and did you see that? It's changed. I'm gonna equip another one, and I still have the same. So this is the way to go, because for example, if I take that one, it's gonna cost to me 480 to enhance one more level. So it's more expensive and I'm gonna get the same increase. So let's search for relics. That one might be good though. If I can get the clone tomorrow, we are gonna have the skill rush event and he's gonna have more damage and that's cool. That one is gonna be perfect with the clone. And I unlocked that one. So I'm gonna put that one and look at that. It costs to me only 100 shards to level up that one to level 2. And I'm gonna get all the time a 16% stats increase. No matter the level, did you see that? Okay, so let's search for other relics. Some damage resistance, that one might be cool. And I'm gonna equip that instead of the others because, th yeah, let's be honest, that one is for boss levels only and that one too and that one is for every content in the game. So of course that one is gonna be way better for me. 5% damage resistance of all sources, this is amazing. Let's continue searching for relics. Some heals every time I'm using these two skills. More damage on three different skills. More damage on basic attacks during Blitz Assault. This is the skill. I want that and I really do hope that tomorrow I'm gonna get both that one and the clone. Yeah, I love dreaming. Two immortal ones. So let's continue the research. Yeah, that one is gonna be great as well. Look at that, at the start of the battle, 1% more attack per second up to 10% more attack during the fight. Of course, it's gonna be great. So I don't know if I'm gonna use the damage resistance or the attack one. Okay, so let's continue. More damage to bosses, 45k relics to search others. Okay, why not? And I still haven't unlocked the one in the middle. But now it's gonna cost to me 51k. This is huge. 80% more damage on Grim Reaper. And the last one I can unlock. I hope it's gonna unlock the one in the middle. And I think it didn't. Okay, so I still don't have the one in the middle. So I have everything in every category, but the next one is probably gonna be the one in the middle. Or I can't search for relics again. So it says that I unlocked every relic, 30 on 30, but how do I unlock that one? Is this coming in the future? So it doesn't matter. I'm gonna enhance these ones. And this is the stats the relics are giving to me. So these are the relics I'm gonna use for now. The mask to have some extra combo. That's perfect because I am an archer. I'm gonna use that one, that crystal, to increase the damage of my octopus. I'm using that one to increase the duration of Disarm, Dazzle and Smoke Bomb. And I'm using both Disarm and Smoke Bomb. This is Disarm. The target won't be able to attack during 3 seconds. So that's one of the best you have in the game. And this is the smoke bomb. During 5 seconds, the target is gonna take 30% more damage from every source. And I don't have Dazzled. It's an extra stun for 1.5 seconds. Then I'm gonna use that book to increase my attack over time. And that one to prepare for when I'm gonna have the clone. And finger crossed, I really do hope that I'm gonna get lucky tomorrow and obtain the clone. And I was able to complete the first round and I need an extra 90k to complete the second round, so I'm gonna I'm gonna get that during the week. And I'm currently top 4. So guys, that was all for the video, I hope you enjoyed it. If it's the case, as always, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. If you are planning to spend in the game, don't forget to use AppToWin and my code MESHROOM at the right of the screen. It's a way to support my channel and to save a lot of money for you, because you are gonna get a ton of cashback on every purchase. Have a nice day and see you in the next time, bye bye.